just me bringing you another update. Please stay to the end of the video. Leave a like, it helps the video. Subscribe if you haven't subscribed. And let me know what you think in the comments as usual. Conservative movements by fighting for what they say is their members' religious rights. Now, the Satanic Temple's taking on religion in schools, using new laws in several states to try and get Satanist ministers inside classrooms. With the election of Donald Trump and the rise of evangelical nationalism, I think the more this happens, the more our numbers grow. The monument depicts Baphomet, an anthropomorphized winged goat figure associated with occult and mystical traditions, with two children at his feet. And exploiting God-fearing Republicans' belief in the devil is one of their tactics. They harness the power of satanic imagery and symbolism in dramatic public demonstrations. So here it is in all its glory, the offending Ten Commandments monument. It's in the surrounding grounds of the Capitol. It's protected, as you can see, by these sturdy bollards because the first day it was erected last summer, a man drove into it with his car, destroying it. This is why I tell people that these guys are not different in any way. They are just the same thing. They are two wings of the same bird. They actually do the same thing. They actually want to get to the same goal, but they are just struggling for who's going to get there faster. And the truth is that the Democrats will just take you there faster. The Republicans will take you there slower, but they are still the same thing. Anyone who thinks they are different has been played. That's the truth. And quite frankly, anyone has the right to um, endorse Trump, but think about it this way. Trump will not um, reject the endorsement, you know, he won't, it's bad for publicity. But as a Christian, yeah, he should reject something like that, but you won't see him because the political post is not a religious post, so he's not going to do that. This is actually far deeper, far crazier than we ever... Think you live in a free country? Think again.